Oh, <laughs> hello everyone and welcome to Plus Central's panel of the people. I am your head moderator of this discussion, Lauren Swirls, joined by my good friend Ellie, our second moderator. Please join me in welcoming today's panelists for today's discussion on the chaos of the plush verse. Today we have, on my right, we have Bunnies Hopkins, the bunny who has discovered the plush verse phenomenon that has forever changed our society. She is joined by her great friend, Ruby Alpha Sapphire. And our final two panelists are Petunia and Wilbur Winson of Petunia's Classroom. Plus Central's only education system. Today, we're going to be talking about current issues going on in Plus Central and how we as citizens can help out during, without changing government during this crazy phenomenon. Changing government? Ha! It's about time! Plus Central has put too many crazies into office for far too long. <laughs> we don't need to get into any of that right now, dear. Uh, we'll start with this lady next to bunnies. Uh, Ruby Ava Sapphire, what do you have to say about this? <laughs> hey, Reba, she just got here. She's kind. She didn't, she didn't know what she's getting into. This way she always starts to know, know this place, Reba. Shh. Anyways, before I was really interrupted, our government seems to go through tons of changes that I think many people just aren't okay with. I mean, personally, I've only been here for a few days and I've noticed that a lot of things that need changing. I'm working on helping my friends be aware of what's going on right now. Mr. Winston, do you have something you to add to this discussion? Well, I was just trying to say that, you know, change has been rapid this past couple of years, and I think that's what most people are afraid of, but, you know, it's bound to happen with all this chaos. Well, I think it's great that you all have something to say about this issue, and you can all use what you have to make Plus Central a better place. Heh, <laughs> make Plus Central a better place. <laughs> that's funny. Why is that so humorous, honey? Well, I mean, I'm just trying to face the facts here, face reality. Just because Plus Central wants to change, it's going to take more than just the government to change on its own. Hmm, you got a point there, Mrs. Petunia. You really do. That brings us to our first discussion about where we all stand on the political reform. Since Plus Central is going through an entire political reform right now, where does everybody stand on this? Well, going off of what my wife has been kindly trying to say, don't push it, Weeba, I'm alive here. Well, building up what my wife has said, it could take years to completely reform our democracy, <laughs> even if we get a better chance of that this time. But I'm just in favor of this political reform as a whole, because it could do some real good for Plus Central and other forms of government out in our world. Well, I'm the one that's discovered the entire plush first phenomenon, and that we have all these variants running around, it's given us a sense of diversity and inclusion. Rather than focusing on its dangers, and, and of course, obviously, multiversal travel is very dangerous and has a lot of consequences, but I think we can all learn from one another, and I think our president is trying to realize that we're trying to be different in other, from other realities and trying to be whole again. That is a very good point. I just wanted to say about, I just learned about Plus Central's secret war, and I do think this reform is not going to be easy. I'm on the fence where this is going to take us. Oh, brother, blah, blah, blah. Why don't we just focus on what really matters here? Is how in the world are we supposed to teach these kids about the, pr the plus verse? It's crazy. <sighs> I was just getting to that, Miss Petunia. It seems like... A lot of plus central citizens have a problem with Petunia's classroom being the only education system. I don't understand why that's a problem! Like, why is that such a hot button issue? Petunia's classroom is one of the most successful education systems in the world, and especially in plus central where others have failed. Well, honey, the reason why the other education system has failed because everybody that's tried to do their own has eventually made it to Petunia's classroom. Are you trying to tell me something, Weebat? What's that supposed to mean? I'm just saying that people want more of a, a, a choices for education. Well, if people don't like my chaos, then they can get out. It's not my fault Plus Central does not want to pay government funding for my school system, or any school system for that matter. They barely even want to pay for mine. Yes, the government really should focus on spending for Petunia's classroom. It's been a hot-button topic since its start. Anything that doesn't resort is a significant government interest gets left in the dust. 
<sighs> you bring up a good point, Ruby. You sure do. I'd like to teach these government officials what really is a significant interest. My protest on their property! Okay, okay, we're getting a little off topic here, Petunia. Actually, this kind of brings us on topic even more, Lauren. Uh, it brings us even further together on this topic. The government spending is a hot-button topic, and they put more money towards the armed forces rather than helping the actual people get back to their realities. That's a big problem. Not to mention that the labeling of variants is completely uncalled for. I mean, once the government stepped in and made their own regulations... And they're the ones that started making it look like it's a bunch of chaos. Things just got out of hand because they think they can control it. They, I think somebody higher power, higher, higher power than us, is trying to make it like chaos. And Plus Central is helping them. Hmm. That's a good point. Yeah, that's a good point. Yeah, yeah, that's a, that's a very good point. And you do bring up a good point point about with government regulation spending. What I want to know is where, like, what you guys think led to the president's overall decision in the first place. <laughs> Who did that? Oh, that's just Bob. Oh, I Looks like he's fighting day. another version of himself. Would you guys get out of here before I club you both into the next reality? Would you believe that? The audacity they had to interrupt our show I think it just goes to show that Plus Central needs a better way to deal with that, the chaos that is brought to us by the Flesh Furs. If you ask me, Ruby, which you haven't, I say Plus Central should not have gotten involved with the Plush Furs and the whole multiverse crap to begin with. Normally, I disagree with you, honey, but, you know, the chaos seems to be what's hogging the attention. What did I say about using pig slurs, Weebear? Pig slurs? Yeah, what well, you just said right now, pig brain. Okay. Okay, we're going to take a short PSA break, and hopefully we can get back on track here. Hey, it's not my fault you want to have hot-button issues that have nothing to do with the plush furs. I think this has a lot to do with the plush furs. Hey, Weebear. Yes, honey? Have you voted for plush Central's political reform today? No. Help! I guess things just seem to happen to people who don't vote for the political reform. Do you like to eat at Chef Kirby's Master Chef Fancy and Fast Food Restaurant? Mm, well, gee, I don't know. I'm not, I'm not too sure. I don't approve of the violence in their television commercials. Well, I guess we should just leave that up to the hands of fate. Ah! I guess you gotta be positive when choosing your favorite restaurant in Plus Central. Hi, everyone. I am Lauren Swirls, the head moderator of Plus Central's Panel of the People. If you like what you're watching, please stay tuned to see if we can actually get back on track with our discussion. Well, what happens if we don't, Lauren? Well, I'm sure there's probably going to be a smackdown. Oh, that's a load of baloney. Ah! <sighs> she never listens to me. Someday she'll learn. Gee, those are some pretty straight-up forward commercials, weren't they? They sure were. I wonder why Plus Central decided to choose those commercials. I don't know if it was Plus Central that chose those commercials, but heh, I look like a pretty good movie star already. Uh, 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 yeah, those are some commercials, all right. Uh, I think they're going to help me pay for my bill after this episode. <laughs> Welcome back to Plus Central's panel of the people. We, <laughs> we left off trying to get back on our topic of a new political reform in the chaos of the Plush Furs. Now, Petunia, where do you feel about this issue again? I still say the real issue here, Lauren, is how are you supposed to teach the, these kids about the multiverse? Like, how does the government expect the kid to teach us about the Flashmas? Like, gosh, it's so hard. I think we should start with the changing government. The changing government in Plus Central has been needed for quite some time. And, you know, we've seen people get impeached every year and make new laws that end up getting repealed left and right every day. Rita, how does that explain in relation to the multiverse to my kids? Well, being a student in your class, Mrs. Petunia, I think that students will best understand how it begins with our government being crazy and that the multiverse was just a tipping point that required a change. <sighs> oh, my gosh. It should not have taken an entire phenomenon of a multiverse to change our society. 
People need to get their heads out of their butts and realize that times are changing, and so are we. Pop Central's little trivia toy is not going to solve every government problem here. It's not going to solve the problem on its own, too. Well, I get why not everybody wants a political reform, because they're just afraid of the change. <laughs> Last time I think Pop Central tried to reform, it caused a war. Shh! Don't say that! They're going to censor it. Ah, uh, it's okay, guys. They're gonna censor it anyway. So let's just how Plus Central ro rolls. They need to fix that as well. It's our right to say what we want to say, unless it gives clear and present danger or harms someone else's reputation. <sighs> they don't care about anyone but themselves. Now, Lauren, we talked about this. We talked about being civil. Oh, forget that, Ellie. I'm trying to make a point here. Plus Central needs to hear the truth. Hmm, bad. I like this one, Reba. <sighs> we said, ooh, this is not how I thought this was going to happen, especially live. Like, I'm surprised Plus Central hasn't even taken us down yet. <sighs> I think it's all these bozos we had impeached over the years were just examples of why we neglected to change. You said it, Petunia. <sighs> that lead us to the foundation of what Plus Central should not be known for, and it's why we need this show to change that. Uh, well, I said what needed to be said. Anyone want to go to dinner tonight? Honey, we're still alive. Oh, who cares, we bet? Nobody cares anymore anyways. Nobody in the parent decides anyways. Hey, get back here. All right, that's it. I told you guys that we're going to crummy the next reality. Now you're getting to join the club. Ah! Oh, I'm you like that, huh? This. You like all this? No, I gotta go oh, find please. Oh, I can't do this, this all day. Oh, you like that, huh? You like that? Get out of here. Oh, well, wow, it <laughs> certainly has been quite a show. Uh, thank you guys for tuning in. Please feel free to drop your opinions on the topics we discussed in our email box below. We'll be back next week with a whole new cast of panelists to discuss a completely different topic of our choice. Am I was supposed to do that? You know who's the lead moderator here? Uh, next time I'll help out with a comedy show. Man, they really need to organize this better. They can't organize it any better because of the chaos of the, the plushverse. This is definitely shows an example of how chaotic the plushverse has made everything. It really has. I told you I was supposed to be the lead person, not you. Well, I just wanted to try to make things... My job is to try to be a moderator, you know, try to make things smoother. But you're not making anything smoother. You're making it more harder. Reba, I told you we want to go for ice cream. I don't want to go for ice cream. You go for ice cream, Reba! And Bob and Batball are getting ice cream shoved up their bums. Goodness gracious. I know Bat and Bob and Batball are causing a problem. I don't think they cause that much of a problem. Uh, should we be going somewhere? Should we be studying for Virginia's classroom? No, I don't want to do that assignment. I, I think it's boring, you know. And, and see, they want us to do a whole bunch of other assignments and stuff. Who wants to do that, right? We have all week to do. We don't need to do anything else. Exactly. Like, gosh. Ugh. Well, I apologize for how Petunia was acting. I really do.